Hello and welcome to you all as our coverage of the opening fixture of the International Champions Cup gets underway. It is a slightly new concept for some of you, but it is a special invitation event held both stateside and in Asia, as it has been since 2013. Interest in the competition has been phenomenal. It has drawn in crowds of over 100,000, which signal again that football is indeed a worldwide sport. Can he put it away? Danger averted for now. And it's Messi. Pasquale. He's had a shot! Fair attempt, just the wrong outcome. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. Salvio tries to get it forward quickly and it's Marco Asensio Pasquale can he deliver Bruno Salto big chance goal Barcelona Barcelona are in front a truly wonderful strike decorated with dip and curl yeah and it's not a surprise to see him elect to shoot from there considering how much movement can be generated on the ball great hit Barcelona take the lead 1-0 and that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting it's the belly sticks it away and already they're looking to run away with it Oh, that was a cracking little exchange to set up the finish and a lovely understanding between both players. I mean, that's clearly tailored on the training ground and delivered beautifully on match day. So that's two now without reply. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look... Hits one! Well, that's pretty clear. It is a foul. Well, he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, I think the referee would have told him to. And we've reached half-time. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, they had their opponents reeling in that half, Peter, and the break may influence the change somehow, but don't hold me to it. Barcelona sitting pretty here at half-time. 2-0 up. And we're already back on the way here. Played into space out wide. Tries a header! Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Salvio. It's gone a long way up and away. Well, the referee's pulled play back and has booked him for the original offence. Dembele, good energy in defence as well. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. It's Marco Asensio. Messi has created one goal already. Aimed long and direct. Dembele. He's gone for it. Oh, it looked like 3 0 for sure. He'll be fuming with himself for not converting. He could have killed it off. Goes for goal. Big relief. It just needed better contact. minutes left on the clock 
Pasquale. Rafinha. Suarez looking to get on the end of this. Can he finish? The whistle has gone and it is all over. Well, the manager heads down the tunnel, swathed in satisfaction.
So hello and welcome to this most glittering, extravagant early season gala where the two major prize winners of European football get proudly to parade their trophies ahead of this special clash which is going to get going in a few moments from now. There are a few better spectacles than this as we wait with huge excitement for the curtain to rise on what we hope will be another highly entertaining and dramatic European club football campaign. This famous, famous stadium, for so long, one of the symbols of Italian dominance in Europe. So this, I guess, Jim, the perfect way to whet our appetite ahead of the European club season. Yeah, it is, Peter, and pleasing for me to, to see this kind of one-off crack at silverware being taken really seriously. It's a first chance to gauge how each team can... And the finish! Rafinha tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, it's Marco Asensio. Oh, really tidy interchange. As Pliqueta boots it to safety. Marco Asensio... Timely intervention. He's had a go! He's been off try. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. Rafinha. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Is it in? Morata over to the left just brushed off the ball there and Titi aimed long and direct surely he scores and the shot oh the keeper's done ever so well well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Played back in. We can get that clear. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? And we've reached half-time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. Off we go once more. Barcelona playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline. Converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Lovely feet. Oh, that's been repelled. Oh, great defending. That needed doing. Now it's Morata. Rafinha hits one forward it goes this defence is, is wary about opposition pace so they're just not getting too tight yeah they know that if they, they step up their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier Adriano it's come loose Barcelona showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Back into the middle. Shakes the shoots. Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. Oh, maybe it was one of those moments when he just caught it too well. Now 
some movement on the bench and we are going to see a change. So we have a double substitution going on here. Morata needed to come up with a better ball. Morata encouraged the pass with an intelligent run, but the pass just lacked pace. Good offside that time. And here's a change that was in the offing. Last one allowed. I think this is going to add an entirely different dimension to their attack now. They've got the physical presence, they've got a real aerial threat, and uh, it looks more promising from here. Christensen, Kovacic spreads it towards the left. The 90 minutes are up, 30 more to come. Well, nil-nil doesn't offer a fair reflection on what we've seen. The game's been vibrant, I think the atmosphere has remained buoyant, and we just need the scoreline to, to step into line. So a brief breather, and then extra time. Well, we are already up and running again. Messi goes looking. Kante plays it for just the goalkeeper to beat. He's through, now is he in? Titi did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contact. He'll have a dip! Aimed long and direct. A mixture of good defending and indecisive pass. He's good for it! Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Point in extra time. Well, there's plenty of potential for a final twist in this tale. I think there's bound to be some late drama in the final 15 minutes of this epic. Exhaustion, physical and mental. Will we find a win? Has a hit! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Should have been two. Well, he's definitely kept the side in the game then. That's really good positioning. They could have doubled their lead there. Got to throw in. William. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation. It needs to be any time now, really. Titi gets good distance on it. Coutinho and Coutinho and that is the last effort of the game
So it is Super Cup Day, a clash of two of the finest. This, of course, a part of the world where the game holds a very special place in the hearts of many. Every game is a grand occasion. You simply cannot beat this. Blue and burgundy wherever you look. Hymns ringing loud and proud. This is what it is to be... Shoots! It's in! And some of the best managers I've played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. The first touch was absolutely heavenly and because of it, the finish was a mere formality. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Dembele, and a header! He's got away with one there. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Balls loose, who's getting there? And it's Shibasaki. He's had a go! Oh, good effort, he got plenty on that. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. He's being closely tested here. Marco Asensio. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Bruno Salto dinks one in. There really wasn't very much in that. Far away from being a telling final ball. Barcelona seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was Eat Hill have a dip! Oh, taken with style! A two-goal lead and they're firmly in control. Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. be the last act of the first half reflections on the first half well it's looking pretty straightforward Peter they've got themselves into a, a very good position so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength Barcelona sitting pretty here at half time 2-0 up already up and running for the second half Adriano Oh, good interception. Tries to get it forward quickly. Over to the left. The ball's loose, and he's after it. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. Cleared without complication. Adriano. Nicely measured pass. And it's Marco. Hits one! And more, and more, and more! And the lead is extended still further. Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Oh, that's excellent composure because the keeper put as much pressure on as he could by not committing sooner. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. 
Messi coming on. Can he continue his terrific scoring impact on the competition? There's a player in need of attention here. Yeah, and the manager's concerned too. Substitution time perhaps, or maybe not. We'll see. But it appears he's going to be OK, at least for now. What an adventurous run from a defender. Loose ball, who's going to get that? That's gone a long way up and away. Adriano. Rafinha is demand. Big chance! No mistake! Surely now they are well and truly out of sight. It's become a case of men against boys. Cuts it out. And it's hoisted clear. Messi. Now it's Marco Asensio. And that's been levered clear. And that is that.
Well, good evening to you wherever you are in the world. We are just about ready for the action here. Kickoff is imminent. The teams indeed with us very soon, having exchanged their various pleasantries. What I have to tell you is that the weather may not be great for the duration of the evening. The clouds are yet to open, but one suspects that they will pretty shortly. And when the rain comes, we are warned to expect plenty of it. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. This is the lineup we've been given. How do you read it, Jim? Well, the modern version of that is a lot more fluid and flexible than in bygone times. There is a much greater understanding of the need for players to cover forward running and it enables risk-taking while the gaps are filled. I'm very much a fan of it. There are a lot of people who seem to have kind of ignored it and just put it to bed, but it still works. It's still valid. And I think we're going to see it be successful here. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Both teams have enjoyed the perfect start. Two wins from two, so something's got to give here. And he's there to hoof it away. Adriano. Marco, Marco Asensio! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Marco Asensio sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Ditch defending, but that'll do. And it's Pasquale. A really good feat from him. Saul demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. He's gone for it! Dembele hit into the middle and he heaves it forward Adriano still waiting for the first goal oh, it's Marco has hit one oh the keeper's done ever so well oh that's a sparkling save absolutely sparkling his reflexes were ultra sharp Is it in? He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Messi with the short one. Meets it first time! That is wayward. Philippe Coutinho. Oh, it's Dembele. And it's the whistle for half time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. So there was the first half. Barcelona ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. And a shot! Marvellous goal! Well, when one or two others were maybe a tad slow at restarting this game, then up steps a big character who was simply switched on and bright. And he sparked another advantage for his team at an important stage. It augurs well. Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb.
Barcelona take the lead. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. And he's onside. Cleared without complication. That's gone a long way up and away. A synth shapes the shoots. Oh, that's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and just get something in the way. Marco Asensio. Boudin plays it forward. Now the counter. Well, we don't need to guess that they expect plenty of, of ball into the box. <laughs> it's quite a crowd scene in the middle now. Well, it's a situation that requires resilience now and, and plenty of fighting spirit. It has to be matched. Deflected behind for a corner kick. So the ball's got out of play and a change is upcoming. Pascal knocks it away. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Savage tries to get it forward quickly. He's got away. Oh, nice touch. Lamar plays it out to the wing. Chooses to go back. Out to the left it goes. Ter Stegen deals with it effortlessly. And that is that. Terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal in it. But that was enough. Well, this game looked to have nil-nil written all over it. But credit to them. They upped their game in the end. And I thought they got what they deserved.